Hi friend, today I'm gonna to show you the easiest way to route audio from your DAW to OBS when using a PC. So some of the reasons why you might wanna send audio from your DAW to OBS is that it'll give you access to all the effects that are already in your DAW, such as reverb and delay, compression and EQ. You can use those on your vocals. You can bring in multi-tracks into your DAW and have them all mixed in there and just give yourselves nice, clean, professional audio to use for your live streams. We're gonna be using a free plugin from Reaper called Restream to do this, so let's get started. The first thing we need to do is download and install a free plugin called Restream, which is created by Reaper. It's part of a free plugin bundle called Replugs. So we'll go ahead and download that and go ahead and install it. Now you can choose to install all the plugins that are in the bundle, or if you only want the Restream plugin, which is what we're using today, then you can uncheck the rest. Now that we've installed that, let's head over to our DAW. I'm gonna be demonstrating using Ableton Live, but you can do this using any DAW that supports third-party plugins. So first we'll go to our plugins folder, and then you'll see here all the plugins that we installed, and the Restream standalone plugin is the one we want. Now what you want to do is put this on your master bus track, which for us is right here, and you're going to make sure that's the last plugin in your chain. So have that show up after your limiter. Next, the identifier, you can leave this just a default, this is just the name, but if you do change it, make sure you know what you're changing it to. So we'll leave that at default. And then here, receive or send. So in our DAW, we're gonna be sending audio out of our DAW, so we're gonna switch this to send. And then under this pull down list, we're gonna select local broadcast, because we're gonna be sending the audio locally just within our own computer. And now let's just play a little bit of audio through our DAW to make sure it's passing through the plugin. There's only love left in this house. Now there's only love left in this house. So you saw there that indeed there was audio coming through the plugin here. So the next step is now to move over to OBS. Now in our sources, we need to create a new audio input capture. So we'll click the little plus button. We'll go to audio input capture. And we can rename this whatever we'd like. I'm gonna rename it DAW. And now under device, you wanna select an unused input. If all your inputs are already being used, then I'm gonna show you a little workaround. I'm gonna select input three, four, which I have my vocal mic currently coming through input three. So you'll see that here. So this is my vocals. Now we're gonna to go to filters. So we're gonna right click on our DAW source and go to filters. And now if you're doing this on an unused input, then you can skip the following two steps. But if you don't have any unused inputs, then you wanna click on the plus button here and go to gain. I'll just keep this called gain. And I'm gonna bring this gain all the way down. And now you'll see here that it removed some of the gain from my voice, but we're still seeing a little bit of signal here. So all we're gonna do is do that once more. Bring this down again, and now you'll see that we don't have any vocals coming through this track anymore. So we've basically created an unused channel. So now that we have a clean channel to work with, we'll hit the plus button once again, and we're gonna add a VST 2.x plugin. Now this one I'm gonna rename Restream. Now under plugins, we're gonna select the Restream standalone. So the same one we selected in our DAW. And now I'm gonna open this plugin interface. So the identifier, you're gonna to wanna to make sure this is the same as what it was set in your DAW, which we left to default. And now in OBS, we're gonna have this set to receive. So now we'll go back to our DAW, press play, and make sure we're receiving audio in OBS. There's only love left in this house. 
That is only love left in his house There's only love left in his house There's only love left in his house There's only strength left in his house And there you go. It's just that easy. If you want to learn more live streaming tips and tricks, make sure to download my free live streaming like a pro quick start guide by following the link in the description below. If you like the music you heard in this video, make sure to check out my good buddy, Mr. Jimmy Baldwin, which I'll link in the description below as well. I hope you enjoyed the video and we'll see you in the next one. <laughs>